Okay, so the question was, can 360 be used um, for other purposes other than development, so things like promotion and selection? Um, and it's our belief that, yes, uh, it can be used for those sorts of purposes, um, although we feel that probably the value will remain in using it as a development tool, and that's uh, its primary purpose. It can actually be used for other purposes as well. Um, but obviously that needs careful management, uh, it needs positioning properly, um, you have to get the communications right about it. Um, but it can provide, provide a whole load of useful data which can support other talent management um, practices. So we have some clients that are currently using it for things like succession planning, um, for making promotion decisions, and for evaluating things like training, so looking at leadership development programmes and the impact, the behavioural impacts of those. Um, you've got to get the right level of agreement from people who go through the 360 process on doing that. Obviously, you need to get them to agree and sign up to that. Um, but you can, we feel, um, get a higher return on your investment in 360 if you broaden its use. So you can get lots of rich data um, with the right controls. Um, you can apply it to things like promotion and succession planning, identifying high potential, um, but you have to put the right controls in place in order to do so.